Hi everyone, I got a surprise delivery of my Modern Horizons 3 gift bundles today. I got three of these, uh, and I already have cracked two of them, but I figured I would um, go ahead and capture, uh, open it up one of these for video. Um, so, you know, we're going to get our, our land packs, you know, foil and traditional. Um, there's nine play boosters. Um, uh, there's the, um, power balance, uh, you know, bundle version, the fancy box. Um, but there's also a collector booster inside along with a fancy little spin down counter. Um, uh, so let's, uh, crack into this. Let's see here. There's the box, and there's also art insert here. So, layer of cultivation, I think. Um, and uh, here's some of the profile um, profile creatures. So here's the cameo box now they've gotten rid of the little um black uh dice holder things um they don't do those anymore um they still they still do these uh you know punch out counter insert things but here so we got a sparkly translucent, you know, turquoise-ish spin-down counter. So that's actually pretty cool. So yeah, I, I, I buy sets just to have, I buy bundles to have at least one of the spin-down counter per release since I've started uh, buying stuff. So there's our collector pack. Um, here's our, so I'm not going to bother going into the land packs. Um, they're not going to be that, that interesting. Um, power balance, it's not particularly valuable. Um, they have a bundle version of the foil, um, in there. Um, but here's our one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we got nine packs. And I'm just going to go through them quickly, um, really, to just kind of see. We get snow covered waste, half of annihilation, priest of Titania, spring heart, Nantuko, and there's a foil and a token. So I like this as a green card, so I'm ha happy to have extra copies of it. Um, it's like the first stuff that I opened up. There wasn't, uh, I wasn't hitting it. Siege Mask, Aether Spike. I'm trying to see if Sneaky Snacker, I've seen posts about that, um, for events. Static Prison, Royal Cartographer, Branching Evolution, so. Nice to have a copy of that, plus Arena of Glory, um, and a foil Solar Transformer, a land and a treasure. Okay. Refurbished Familiar, I think that's another one that's been making the rounds. Uh, Bountiful Landscape, Pyritic Rebirth, Disciple of Frailes, so I, I'm a green player, so extra tools in the toolbox, uh, Nesting Grounds, Flare of Malice, so this is the, you know, sacrifice it to get it free, sacrifice something to get the free spell, um, Black Version, um, Thriving Skyclaw, and an Art Card.
Okay. Right. There's another refurbished. Sticking. Uh, inscription Ral and the Implicit Maze. I don't even know if I've seen that before. Um, but I haven't delved in to the lower levels of the cards, except for like the green stuff. Shrieking Drake. Okay, a Shifting Woodland is the rare there. Uh, revitalizing Repast. A Mountain. In there. Okay. Mixborn Unicorn <laughs> Foul Strike Break your Last Another Solar Transformer A Lion Umbra So a new a new Umbra So now they call it Umbra Armor um, Drowner of Truth Wirewood Symbiote a volatile Storm Drake. Harry Auxiliary. Okay. Glimpse the Impossible. Nice art. To a goblin breaker of creation, Urza's cave. So that's interesting because you could search your library for a land card, put it onto the battlefield, tapped, then shuffle. So you can tutor yourself a land, one of the more broken lands that you can get away with. Um, Angel of Ruins, Ocelot, Pri Ocelot Pride. Um, yeah, so. Make a lot of cats. Uh, Faithful Watchdog and Mountain. A blank token. Okay. Evolution Witness. Grim Servant. Eldrazi Ravager, Emerald Medallion, um, Invert Polarity, a foil version of Gift of the Viper, that's nice, uh, Planes, and a sign, sign, you know, signature art card. Okay. Uh, it looks like we got a one of the profile cards in there. Uh, Wither and Bloom, Siege Smash, Cranial Ram, Tamio meets the Story Circle, Skittering Precursor, a Johnny Fells the Godsire, Stump Stomp, uh, which is one of these. MDFC cards, Burn Willow Clearing, Junk Diver, Monumental Henge, and we have uh, Pearl Ear Imperial Advisor in foil, in a foil profile, so that's kind of nice, uh, and an Eldrazi Spawn. Okay, the last of the regular play boosters. Fell the Profane. Reform. I love that card. Uh, Nethergoif. Nethergoif. A twisted Landscape. And a Forest. 
So there, there was some stuff I like in there, but we don't. Th I don't think we struck gold really. But here is our collector pack. Let's see what kind of luck we have with this. Okay. Contaminated landscape. Gift of the Viper. Expel the unworthy. Faithful watchdog. Hard Shadow Spinner. Barbarian Ring. Bridgeworks Battle. Uh, just Tangle Span Bridgeworks on the back. Uh, mountain. Foil. Full Art. Um, Galvanic Discharge. Unholy Heat. So, I mean, it's only a common, but these uh, retro foils really, really pop. Um, Aether Revolt is our first uh, rare. Geote Moag Ancient. Uh, Harbinger of the Seas. Oh, Ocelot Pride in the um, Borderless version. I think this qualifies as Borderless. Um, so that's good. And a Wooded Foothills. In... I don't know if that's extended art or, yeah, I guess maybe it's extended art. Uh, foil. And then an Eldrazi Scion, Eldrazi Spawn, and Fanatic of Ronus um, token. So anyhow, that's uh, you know that's the the Modern Horizons two um, gift bundle. So you get to play the lottery with uh, with a collector pack. Um, you get your play boosters, and and you get a, a nifty spin down sparkly counter. Um, so. Uh, I hope you enjoy this, and uh, have a nice day. Bye.